I've said it so many times, you know. I think, oh, in fact, I get a bit irritated by over uh, repeating myself. I said, how, how long it takes to get through to somebody? You've got to say uh, 10 times, 20 times, 30 times, 50 times, you know? It, it's a very simple issue. Uh, there's right and there's wrong, you know? There's good and there's bad, there's evil and there's wrong. So, uh, as, as far as the contract is concerned, you cannot add to it. Even Leviticus says in the Bible, you cannot add or uh, break a contract. And it, it, these banks do. Up until 81, uh, the Money Lenders Act said very, very clearly the contract will show the total amount of interest payable. Boom, boom, that's it, full stop. And, they, and then the banks didn't like that. They said, they said oh no, we can rip off, rip off people. Uh, we can put through this Consumer Credit Act and uh, have it say that the lender can vary the terms of a contract without your consent. I, 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 I've got a letter at home. They said, we're increasing your uh, monthly payments without your consent. And I said, oh, that's charming, isn't it? Well, I think this form of debt, as imposed by the banks, it really is a modern form of slavery. Absolutely, yeah. It's It's sanitised, perhaps, yep. and it's, it's part of our life, it's part of our society, everyone's accustomed to it. Credit cards running with 18% interest payments and the like. But again, it does represent a form of... Modern slavery. Yes. And that's even defined in the Modern Slavery Act. They talk about financial slavery. In fact, the uh, University of, New of Sydney uh, put out this statement about modern slavery. And they it's mentioning that. And so... That was an official study by the University of Sydney? Yeah, but then, then they turn turtle and I say, well, here it is. And they go quiet, you know, because... Uh, I, I, I would imagine that their study probably would have focused more on things like uh, exploitation wages, yeah, uh, yeah, unfair work conditions. Yeah, they yeah. probably would have, again, to, to repeat myself, they, it would have been a sanitised uh, scenario where they probably didn't really address the banks or the governments. No, because the banks have got control not only of the parliaments, they got c control of our schools. They control uh, our universities. They control the law schools, you know? And they teach the lawyers how to protect the, uh, the corrupt system. They teach the economics. They turn turn on the laws of economics. They say, oh no, you can do whatever you like in the contract. But a contract is an agreement which is duly ex executed and legally binding. They say, oh, don't worry about the binding part. We just do what we like. In fact, these, these modern contracts are not contracts. They are licenses to steal. They are licensed to steal. And this is given uh, given the go ahead by the parliaments and by the judiciary. Uh, and, and it's wrong because it, it is, it's destroying us. They're destroying us in any way they can. And they, they devalue our principles. Uh, and they, they steal. Oh, it just goes on. Uh, we've got no right to property. I think the. The issue with the education system is obviously most people in school or in university, in college, they want to get the best grades, the best marks possible, but the way they do that is simply by parroting or That's repeating right. whatever the teachers tell them. If you want to get a good mark, you've got to repeat what that teacher said to you. If you want to get your ticket, you, you've got, got to spout the lies they've been teaching you. you know, it's, it's the same uh, in dentistry. You've got to sprout the lies about fluoride, okay? And if you want to get your uh, law degree, you've got to sp sprout the laws that they teach you, a corrupt version of it. They teach you, oh, oh the, the parliament has got sovereignty and to decide what cases they've tried by jury. That's wrong. They teach you that the judge has got all the power. They teach you that the judge has got discretion. They've got no discretion at all uh, when it comes to, to facts and truth. And, but they get away with it. The system has been set up so comprehensively. We've got to break the mould. We've got to talk this situation. We've got to talk freedom, and we've got to talk truth.